是好莱坞的动作巨星啊！是的。欢迎《上个运动》中国的合作发行方代表耿展先生，欢迎吕建明先生。这部电影它包揽了制片、导演、编剧、演员四项重要的角色。啊，并且在精彩的打斗场面当中，也首次加入了浪漫的爱情的元素。Hi, Sean. Welcome Hi, to the stage. Thank you. How are you? Wow, 身手矫健。Welcome. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Good evening. Good evening. Would you like to say hi to all your Chinese fans? I'm so happy. It's working. <laughs> of course. I'm so happy to be here. It's a fantastic evening with huge star from China and other countries, and I feel very privileged to be here in your country. And hopefully, we'll do better and better together. Yeah. Yay! <laughs> 他说非常高兴来到上海，能够和这样多的中国的以及来自世界各地的影人们相聚，非常的荣幸。呃，那么我们知道啊，其实这部《英之路》啊，它付出了很多。We know that you put a lot into making this film full of, right? You spent six years making this film. Is that true? Uh, you know, to find love, you need lots of years of practice. Yeah, that's the effort that you need to put into, right? Okay. So, but why why did you choose Shanghai to be the location of the global premiere of your film? Uh, it's because, first of all, uh, I met I met I made a movie here mm -hmm. with my partner, Mr. LV. That's how I pronounce in English, LV. <laughs> okay, and uh, we became very good friends, and uh, I felt. I mean, I live in Hong Kong since 1982, mm -hmm. okay, 1987, and I'm very in touch with the Chinese philosophy, and uh, we became good friends, and uh, he said, why not to show your movie in Shanghai? And uh, he asked the uh, Shanghai Film Festival uh, for a screening, Yeah. and here I am. You think That's it's it. a good idea? Right? A fantastic idea. Fantastic idea. 那么刚才我问到为什么选择上海作为电影《英之路》的首映礼的全球首映礼的这个地点。那么刚才他就说呢，因为呃，上是一九八七年就在香港生活了。那么对我们的中国的这个情况是非常非常的了解，也非常的喜欢。那么跟我们的制作人呢，也成为了非常好的朋友。所以制作人提出为什么不在上海举办呢？他说这是一个 fantastic idea， 特别棒的主意。所以是一个成功的主意。对，成功的主意。Thank you. Thank you so much, Sean. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, I used that uh, cinematographer four times mm -hmm. in my life. Um, and he knows the way I like how the camera is moving. Like a uh, slow motion, uh, um, old fashioned way. Sweaty way, yeah. So the movie has uh, an effect of like an old-fashioned way. And it was very special to find three different colors. Uh, the opening sequence was kind of a new color with a child playing with the eagle. The black and white color was different than uh, Schindler. Uh, in fact. Schindler, the uh, DP of Spielberg, called Doug Nelson to ask him some question about the black and white. So he made our black and white even more contrasted. It looks strange on the first 20 seconds, but then you start to get accustomed. And then when you go to Malaysia, boom, everything is changing, it's becoming hot and sweaty. So those three different colors were there, Louisiana, the war, and the uh, heat of Malaysia.